Hello everyone, this is Leslie. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please think about subscribing. I do content about Target hauls uh, after clearance shopping, as well as what I call my whole shebang, all different kinds of things. I hope you will consider subscribing and liking this channel. I am someone who has always loved going to Target and it um, to, uh, to, uh, the clearance shopping. And about, it, it may be 10 years ago or so now, I discovered the 70 and 90% off clearance and that kind of changed the whole playing field, so to speak. I would go very religiously and one time I remember bringing my second grade daughter with me before school as I was there at eight o'clock. Um, that was six years ago. Um, things are a little different now. This year there are really no opportunities for Valentine's because while our schools, our kids who are in school, they were, they, there were no Valentine's parties, there was no kind of things like that. So the things that I used to get Valentine's items for and save for the following year really have not, there has been no need to do that. Also, I'm trying to be more of a quote, quote unquote minimalist and get rid of things. So I'm trying to limit what I do buy unless I'm going to sell it on eBay, which I, these kind of things I wouldn't sell on eBay. But I just wanted to quickly show you. So on Saturday, which was the 20th, I was around 530 in the afternoon. I looked up something and it got me into all things Target, which I use, I go to frequently for um, shopping. And I noticed that the clearance items had gone to 90%, actually apparently on the 18th. So that was on the 20th. Um, it was starting to get dark here. I was, had to go pick up my daughter at the train. So I said, I'm just going to run, run over. I left here at 5.30. I got back at, you know, the whole trip in the store was maybe 30 minutes. So I just wanted to show you the, the items that I got quickly. I really only ran to the, um, spritz um, aisle. I, in the past, and I'm going to show you that at the end, have gotten a whole bunch of other things there that I've been able to use. But I don't really need that stuff, and I just, um, I'm not trying to only get the things I need. So let me show you some of the things I got. So, this were, were the Spritz Treat Bags. You would have seen this, because the, these were, I think they were $1.50, and I think I paid $0.15 cents for 15 bags. So, that's a penny a peach piece. I will use these, even maybe at, like, Christmas time, if I put, like, green grass in it and like put candy or something so I got these were 15 cents and I got I think six of these bags so I was pretty excited about that um, again a lot of things happen around Valentine's Day and um, you can use them for different events and dances and things like that I I really went whole hog on these on the tissue paper I sell both on eBay and Poshmark and I wrap up items in white tissue paper. However, I use um, other color tissue paper throughout the year. Um, these were both, I believe, I should know this. Oh, I had the receipt over there. I think these were each 15 or 20 cents. So they were originally $2. So again, um, a penny a piece is not bad. I, If you saw my Christmas haul, you know I got all 90 pieces for 30 cents of the white. Um, this is, sometimes you just need a little extra color, that's for that. I then also got this tissue paper, which has all Valentine's and some plain blue. These were also, I believe, 20 cents. I got two of these. These were American Greetings, which sometimes the American Greetings stuff doesn't go on sale. This time it did. Um, I got, I'd say, 20 of these bags there are eight pieces in it. These were 15 cents, I remember. There were a whole bunch of them on the on on the peg, I guess, and just sitting there by themselves, which I thought was suspicious. So I went and, and um, looked them up. This is great for Valentine's Day. It's great for Fourth of July, this color. It's also great for um, Christmas, obviously, for um, putting in bags and celebrating and whatever. This was great. I bought a whole bunch of these which I will put into my, I have a whole drawer just of tissue paper. Um, then I got these. These were originally $3. I got them for 30 cents each. There are these little erasers. They're very heavy. I mean, this is like two pounds of erasers. They're very big sizes. Um, I do make um, Christmas 
I make Christmas for Operation Christmas Child. I make boxes for that. I also do Easter baskets for um, children in Philadelphia who are in some form of crisis. So these I liked a lot. Um, these were 30 cents for two of them. I mean, for, um, for 16, so it's less than two cents each. And there was also a 15% off spritz circle, so you should, if you're go, going out, look for that. I also got this little thing, because I was decorating some cards for my children, actually. This was 30 cents. These were stickers. And there's children down the street that I gave them a little something, and these are just cute to have, like little heart. You can use that all year round. Some of them are the conversation hearts you might be able to see, but some of them are just plain heart. Okay. Oops. Dropped it. Then I did find one package of these 60 count red plates. Again, these were 30 cents, which makes them half a penny each instead of $3. And these were, there were, apparently there, these were available in white and red. I only got the red because I didn't look for or see the white. Um, and again, great for all the holidays that I had mentioned before. Great. I avoided getting these kind of things, but these things were so darn cute. They were originally $5, these spritz. I guess you make them with toilet paper, and I will give them as gifts to the kids down the street. I thought they were really cute. Um, it's a little project. My daughters, believe it or not, will still come over here and do like little cake decorating, or I mean, I think they, if I can save enough toilet paper rolls, they would make these things, and they're really adorable. So that's, that's that. Um, and then I did buy, which they also had this in white, but I only got the red. And again, same philosophy. I got one, two, three, four, five, six packs of these spritz, spritz, plain, um, 60 count napkins, which is amazing for 30 cents, which means each one was half a cent. And it is ridiculous to me. You can buy a pack of, these are the luncheon size. You can buy a pack of, um, for eight, um, for, eight, to get eight, it's like $3. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's 50 cents, a, it's like 45 cents a napkin. These were half a penny. So I got six of those. I also got some of them with other designs, which you would see, if you saw this, you would say, oh, that's Valentine's Day. This was 30 count. These were $3, but they're really cute same thing and this was all at one store in half an hour these were also spritz for three dollars it came up to 30 these were the larger size and there's I'm falling apart here that is um those were the larger size great and cute design and they were a dollar each I mean um a penny each and then I did get this I ran over on my way out and looked in the I had heard, I had seen something very quickly about things for, in the health and beauty. I just happened to see this one. It's called the Cupid Bomb. This, for some reason, was 27 cents. It was in a bin with similar ones that say fun size, the bomb. I checked out the size, exactly the same. And that one was 5.79. So I don't know why this was 27 cents, but it just goes to show you that during these, um, clearance item uh, times you really have to like kind of look because if you're looking for something like that that's just a pink you know cute 27 cents versus 579 saves you a lot of money so I know that I'm I, I wanted to because I didn't get any of the stuff that I used to get in the old days I did want to do a little bit of the stuff that I did used to get and don't need anymore so that you can see what I was talking about first I got and I wanted to show you this heart pillow that I got. I don't know when I got it. I could probably tell you because it would be on the thing. I got this. Oh, it says 2015. It was $1.49. I still use it. I love it. It's my little heart pillow that I put out middle of end of January and it's to celebrate um, obviously Valentine's Day. I love that. This was a tin I got. It was a spritz tin for five. It was 50 cents. And I'm going to show you what I've done with these. I got about eight of these one time. Okay. I'm going to show you what I did. I got <clears throat> in, what year was it? These came out in 2017. So it would have been um, Valentine's Day 2018. 
I don't know why these weren't part of the holiday Christmas ho slash holiday clearance. Instead, they were part of the Valentine the following year, which was 2018. So three years ago, I noticed that these were ringing up 90% off. They were originally $29.99. I got them for $2.99. These are so heavy and so nice. They're wool, 85% uh, 50% uh, wool. They're really nice. It's a thrill, but it's a great size. Very pretty, very, ho you know, I think hol holiday type um, colors. So what I've done is I've gotten two of these because I, I literally bought about 25 of them and have them in a big t bin. These were $1.69 at the same time. Let me just check that to make sure I'm not lying to it. Yep. And these came down to $1.69. So these are these nesting homes, if you can see the picture there. So what I've done is I've put this and two of these in a bin and tied it up nicely and given this as um, like an engagement gift, like because they're going to have a new home and they're two little throws. And that was $6, $7.79 instead of $78. Um, so I've done that and that... I've been really happy with being able to give away a whole bunch of those gifts. I also got, this is something we use every Valentine's Day. This was a Nordic Ware pan that makes these cute little um, waffle, uh, no, uh, pancake. It's for pancakes. And I do this every Valentine's Day for my kids. And it's really cute. They love it. They actually ask me about it all the time. This is a, I'm going to use this. I got this at... It's an Opal House wreath, obviously Valentine's Day, and I will give this again as a engagement gift. My niece just got married, and I'm going to give this. I it was she was supposed to get married, but she couldn't because of the pandemic, so she got married, and then she's having a party later. But anyway, long story short, she is that's what she's doing. Oh, I wish I hadn't done that. Um, she is having this wedding, like her celebration is going to be later. So I was making her up this thing. This was a Starbucks mug that I got uh, maybe one or two years ago. And I'm going to put all these things in for her wedding. Um, these were tins, which that's what that sound was. Um, I apologize. These Valentine's themed cookie cutters. I got these a couple of years ago at Target. You can probably see, they're really cute. And um, this was one of my other things that I love. I got these, these were Threshold. I got these for $2.29. I think I got about six of them at the time. I was suspicious because of the red, but other than the red, I mean, I have used this to put in, I have some for myself. I've used this for um, Christmas, I've used this for fourth of july these are great things and what i have done and what i intend to do for my niece is put in a whole bunch of these kind of things that have like heart themed and send these up and put it in this bowl and send it out to her she lives in colorado so that and then my final thing which i got about three of these i've given these away as gifts and i've actually sold three or four of these this is my last one that i will use for myself is this um, you can see it was a dollar uh, $19.99. I got it for $1.99. It is a bake, take, and serve for cupcakes. You put your cupcakes in there and then you put, snap the lid on. This was a great thing I gave to as gifts for lots of moms. Um, because if you know and if you, uh, you really need two of them. If you're going to ever go anywhere with cu cupcakes, it's so great to have this to be able to carry it like this instead of having to worry and about the ice and getting smushed and things like that. So that is this year's, the first part was this year's Valentine, with the things I got for Valentine's Day. The last thing was the stuff I have gotten in past years that I wanted to share with you. I don't think I had my channel back then, so I'm happy that I'm be able to share that with you now. If you like this kind of content and if you um, are interested in getting more of it please subscribe and let me know how you did if you got anything for valentine's day because i love to see and hear this stuff it is actually still actively i'm not sure if you can see this actively 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 snowing outside so we i won't be going out today i today's the 22nd and i thought about it possibly going out and seeing if there was anything out there but mm, i won't be doing that 
Thank you so much for stopping by. This is Leslie, and hopefully I will um, hear from you guys soon. Thanks.